What's going on? Edwin Liddy here with the Liddy Real Estate Group, brokered by JP and Associate Realtors out of Grapevine. Today we're going to do an interview with Connor over at Perry Homes in Rome, Texas. I'm going to have him do a little tour of the house too so we can see what the model home looks like and then we'll get into the nitty gritty after that. Follow me on this tour right here. Connor, my man. Sir, how you doing? What's going on? Connor, Perry Holmes, the man, the myth, the legend. We're going to talk to him today. But before we get into that, why don't you show us your beautiful model home you got going on here? All right. This is our 2895, which means it's 2,895 square feet. It's a four bedroom, three and a half bath. Um, it's got a game room, lovely one story home. Um, so let's go in and take a look at yeah, it. Let's take a look. Follow me. Oh, this is nice. Yeah. Here we've got the grand entryway. This is nice. From the front door, you can see all the way to the back. Tons of natural light. Uh, very open floor plan. To the left, we have a Jack and Jill bathroom. Um, to the right here, a three-car garage. Very and our, nice. And our guest suite. Guest suite. Here at the front of the house. I love the open space. Yes, sir. This is great. This is great. Tall ceilings. Be uh, 12 foot here in the entryway, 10 feet throughout the rest of the house. Um, so yeah, real great for a, a one-story home. We've got some of our two-story homes go up to 20 feet. Wow, this is nice, man. They did they did well on this one. Yes, sir. Yeah, I mean, you just just looking at it, you can you can see that. You know, you walk in, it, it, you're like, how big is this house? Then you get inside, like, whoa, it's really open. One of the uh, most common comments I have when people are touring this model home, I have people guessing anywhere from you know, 3,200 to 3,500 square feet. Um, 2,900 is what it's actually at, but it's, it's way laid out well, very open. Wow, and you have two bedrooms here sure. and a Jack and Jill. Right? Correct. And then over here you have a suite, basically they have their own bathroom. Right, I call it the guest suite, um, just a non-suite. Mm -hmm. And then where the office is set up right office here. Office set up right now. Three car garage on this floor plan. Okay, so when they go to sell this, they'll knock that out and put a three car garage. Yes, sir. Awesome. That's right. Hey, I, I wanted to take a look at these pictures. This is what is to come, right? That's right. That's some yeah, memories that we have. Take a look at this real quick. Uh, the infinity pool, which it's hard to tell from this uh, rendering, but it's overlooking that 20 acre lake that we have out here. Um, some renderings for the entrance of the amenity center. That's nice. That's going to be nice when it's done. So that's part of the amenity center that, yes, they, sir. that they're currently working on. Yeah, I've got some more renderings in the back of the house that okay. have an overview of the whole amenity area, which I think is a little bit nicer. Nice, nice. And this is a map of the actual community? Here's a map of the area with all your kind of local shops and dining and whatever you may need. This is phase one of the uh, 50, 60, and 70 section wow. of, of reunion. Wow. Look, look at this map. Alliance <laughs> is over here by Costco. Yes, sir. So literally, that's your drive. Straight drive. Not even 15 minutes. Or you can jump on 114 and head towards the South Lake, DFW, airport, etc. cetera. Um, this is just a great location. A lot of people don't know this exists. I'm glad you guys did a map to kind yes, of showcase. But show us the rest of the house, man. Yeah. yeah. My pleasure. This is, this is good stuff. Very nice. Wow. Yeah. Look at the size of this island. My goodness. Jeez. I mean, you have seating for four, but you could yeah. easily scoot that over and yes, put sir. some more. Right? Yes, sir. We can. I like to point out the, uh, the storage we have under here. Uh, something that a lot of builders, I feel like, overlook is, I mean, great you don't have space. to waste that space. Right. right. Great use of space. This is like a chef's dream um, to have this much space right here to work and, and to entertain. I love the five burner cooktop, gas cooktop. Yes, sir. Wow, this is a gas community. That's important. It is. Yeah. You've got the double ovens. Yep, showing off the double ovens showing here. Showing off the double ovens, mm -hmm. undermount sink. Man, that's a lot of cabinets back there. I, <laughs> I saw it, but it's like, I'm really paying attention. This is really a good use of space. Look at, wow. Tons of storage. We've got a uh, trash can drawer over here to the side of the sink. Um, pot and pan drawers pulling out there. Very nice. Very, very, it's clean. Clean lines. 
And then there's that rendering I was talking about there in the corner. Oh, of the yeah, let's look face. at this one real quick. Oh, this, oh, yeah, this is a, definitely a better picture right here. This is going to be amazing when it's done. And it's like literally right there. You can see right. they're, they're working on the space. The infinity pool that you're yes, talking sir. about. What, so what's this going to be? That's the clubhouse. That's um, the clubhouse. Yeah, and then the event lawn is what they're calling it. So envision okay. uh, 4th of July out here when everything's open. Oh, yeah. Uh, fireworks over the lake. Everybody in the community grab a picnic blanket and come sit down on the event lawn and have a small concert, whatever the HOA uh, kind of organizes. There's Man, endless possibilities for that's, that. That's going to be that's gonna be great. This is a nice space to you. This is a lot of room right here for a formal dining. Yes, sir. I love the windows, the, the, the height. Yeah. It's like floor to ceiling. That's, that's one night. of our signature looks is those picture frame windows. Um, take up most of that wall and just. Well, it's, the, it's, it's, it's the way they set it up, man. The light coming in. This is just fantastic. It's almost like you're outside. Yes, sir. Yeah. It's awesome, awesome, awesome. I noticed this. Yeah, I love to show this, this one off right here. Sliding door. Oh yeah, see now I'm so they do the sliding door does it for me all the time. So you bring you bring the outside in when you do that. Yes, sir. Um, I can imagine having like the barbecues. I was know. gonna say perfect for entertaining. You've got this perfect. whole space, the game room. Open it up to the uh, the back patio. Yeah, Leo, you just a rainy day. Yes, you know, sir. open it up and you just sit here and have a nap. <laughs> that that breeze coming in wow this is nice man huge covered patio massive wow yeah you can see them working on the amenity center you can see the lake from here also that 20 acre lake over there oh the rolling gosh. hills really unique to this uh for this area in texas these these hills that we have this is great man this is great i'm excited to do this interview today and yeah. just get some more information on the community and really introduce the product to the world. Yes, sir. Um, well, locals, but yeah. if it goes around <laughs> the world, it goes around the world. Show me the, um, the, the primary, suite? primary suite. Yeah, I'd like to take a look at that. Oh yeah, this is nice, man. This is nice. 13 foot vaulted ceiling in here. We added some wood beams. It's grand. It's for sure. grand. Definitely grand. It feels like a primary. Like, hey, this is where I'd want to sleep at night. Yes, sir. You know, that's a great touch with the wood. Absolutely. We'll continue that into the uh, the bathroom here as well. Again, you oh, got that vaulted nice. ceiling with that. Wow. That beam. Yeah, it continued to beam in here. That was a great touch. I love that shower, walk-in shower from the side. Yeah, six foot garden tub. That's gonna be a uh, Perry standard. We got his and hers closets, his separated her vanities. Uh, it's very nice. Frosted uh, glass for privacy. Okay. Yes, sir. But we still oh, got that natural water? light in there. Is that the rainwater finish? Yeah, yes, sir. Yeah, very nice, very nice. I love it, man. Storage. Linen closet. Linen closet. Yep. Oh, yeah. Thought of everything. Thought of everything. Very nice. All right. Well, did I see a game room? I think I saw a game yes, room. Yes, sir. Let's see the game room real quick. That's uh, something that a lot of people are asking for now. Do you have a space for either a movie room or a game room? It's it's a very versatile space. people really want to, it's been used as a form of dining area, um, mm -hmm. media room, office, kids' playroom. So l let's go through this. This is your model home. Yes, sir. I count four bedrooms, right? Yes, sir. I count the Jack and Jill, which connects two mm -hmm. of the bedrooms. The ensuite. Ensuite has his own be bedroom, bathroom. Yes, sir. And you still have room to put a game room. Yes, sir. And we're under 3,000 square feet. We are. Good use of space. Space. Yeah. They thought Knocked this one through. Yes, yeah, sir. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, this is great. Well, let's sit down and talk some more and get, let's, let's just go over, I got a lot of questions, but let's just go over, you know, um, the P's and Q's and yes, sir. see uh, if you could fill my people in on 
Perry Holmes in, in this community. Let's do it. Yeah, let's, 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 let's do it, man. I wanted to do a video kind of showcasing uh, Perry Holmes in Rome. A lot of people don't really know about this area. So I figured you would be like the best person to talk to. Yes, sir. Um, because this is basically where you operate, you know? Right. So um, let's, let's start. I got a list of questions on my iPad. If you see me looking down, I'm just going back to the questions. But tell me a little bit about um, what you do here. So I sell homes for, for Perry. Um, we've got 40 foot, 50 foot, 60 and 70 foot wide lots out here. Mm -hmm. um, we're in phase one as of uh, today of the videoing um, of a 10,000 home community, um, 15 to 20 year project. So a lot of growth out here, um, but I help buyers find the right lot, the right floor plan, the right options that fit them and their uh, family's needs. Okay. So you work for Perry Homes and you sell the Perry Homes product. Yes, sir. And you're really good at it. Speaking from experience, okay, so I didn't just meet him, okay, we've, we've done some deals and I personally had a chance to work with him on one and I have to say I was blown away. Um, Thank you. The thing about realtors and working with builders, reps, sometimes it could be like oil and water. Contentious? Yeah. It, <laughs> <laughs> but um, I mean, it was really, it was fluent with you. You, you just, we were, we, we were in sync. Yes, just, sir. We were trying to accomplish the same goal, which was to get our clients into their new home. Yes, sir. And um, they were in a situation where they had to sell their house to, to buy a brand new Perry. And um, we were able to work together to get it done um, in a timely manner. Yes, sir. So they are very happy with their home, by the way. Love to hear that. Yeah, 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 yeah. But, you know, there's no perfect product. Um, I've dealt, I've been doing this for a long time, so I, I, I've experienced and, and touched a lot of different um, builders and what they offer, but I have to say that you guys build a tight product. It's just, the quality is, is really good. Um, there's no perfect home. I've never seen a perfect house. There's no such thing. You walk a home a million times, yeah. a million the first time you're in that house, you're going to find something that's Absolutely. not 100% right. But you guys literally stand behind your work. And if there's anything that needs to be fixed, you guys are on it. Yes, so, sir. Yeah. Industry leading two year warranty that is bumper to bumper, basically. We cover almost everything in the house for mm -hmm. two years. Industry mm -hmm. standards going to be a one year warranty mm -hmm. there. Mm -hmm. um, and then a 10 year structural foundation warranty where a lot of builders have a six year structure and foundation warranty right now. So we put our money where our mouth is as far as the quality is concerned. Right. And, and on that two year, and correct me if I'm wrong, but the homeowner is still dealing with the builder directly. You're right. Um, our warranty team is the construction team. So the people that built that house and were most hands-on are the ones that are running the warranty team. It's genius. Um, you know, give me a chance to vent. <laughs> I won't say who, but other builders, they, they don't do a two-year. And when they close, you know, they're promised a whole lot by the builder. Hey, don't worry about that. I'll take care of that after closing. But after you close, it, it pretty much it's a handoff to the warranty department. And no one in that department experienced anything prior to. They have no relationship. They didn't touch. They didn't feel. Mm -hmm. They really have no care in the world other than, okay, what do you need done? And they're not in sync. So right. I, I run into a lot of problems now with clients who say, I'm having a hard time getting certain things done because the warranty department is saying the builder should have taken care of that. Yes, and the sir. builder is saying, well, that's why we have a warranty department. And it's like in-house fighting. Yes, sir. And that's not the case here. Right. And some builders even third party the warranty out. So mm -hmm. it's not even the same company that's handling it. Oh, good night. That's a nightmare. Yes, sir. That's a nightmare. So I have to say it's, it's, it's been almost a year and it's like a well-oiled machine. I, I, I want to sell more Perry homes. <laughs> wow. It's like you sleep good at night. I think yes, we sir. were talking about that earlier. It's like, you know, you go to bed and you're like, okay, you had an issue? Did you put a, a, you know, a warranty ticket in or whatever? And yeah, they came out and took care of it. Okay, great. 
I'll talk to you soon. Yes, sir. <laughs> that's, that's the way it should be. But it's not like that everywhere. But at Perry, that's the way it is. Yeah. I love that, man. Yes, sir. I love that. Um, tell me about this community. Where are we right now? Because the average person is not going to look this area mm -hmm. up. They may look at Perry Homes, but they won't necessarily look at this area. Where are we right now? So the name of the neighborhood is Reunion. Um, we are in Rome, Texas. Rome, Texas. So we are on the uh, intersection of uh, 114 and 287. So two major highways. Um, pretty great location uh, northwest of Fort Worth. Mm -hmm. Literally, and it's he says Rome. And, you know, you start to think, where where is that? We're not that far from Alliance. We're not. Um, 15, 18 minutes, depending on traffic. Just uh -huh. down 287, we'll jump you off right there. Yeah. Downtown Fort Worth, around about? 20, 25 minutes. I think I'm starting to pique your curiosity. Oh, where is this community at? Um, it's a great location. Uh, as a matter of fact, it's growing. You, you mentioned that it's a 10 to 15 year project. Um, or 15 to 20. Did you yes, say sir. 15 to 20? Yes, sir. Yeah. So we're in phase one of approximately how many phases? Uh, it really depends on how big the phases are made, but you could expect 8, 10, 12 phases nice. potentially. Nice. When they broke ground, what was the average sales price per home? 70 foot lot. Oh, we were mid, mid sixes, mid to high sixes. Okay. Where are you at now? We've had a couple homes break 800,000. Okay. How long have you been in the community? Uh, a year and a half. Year and a half? Yes, sir. Did I pique your curiosity? You know, most people, they want to make sure they're buying into an investment that is going to be a good investment, that's going to grow in equity. And this community has done that thus far. I mean, uh, the client that, that closed, happy guy you yes, know sir. every time i ask him how's the house he just thought i see all his teeth he's just happy <laughs> he's so happy because he thinks of where he came from and he's, he's, he's looking at the equity growth that he's gotten in such a short period of time and the amenity center is not even up yet they, they're, they're i can look out the window and i can see they're working on getting it up and i think you said that's like a year out from being completed right everything goes to plan uh -huh. yeah i can't speak for the developer but the <laughs> The plan is next summer. Okay. I think when that amenity center goes in, it's going to be a huge draw for people to this community. Just not enough people knows about this community yet. Right. Mm -hmm. Well, awesome. Um, how many floor plans do you have when it comes on to the 70-foot the product and variation? Approximately how many floor plans are you working with? Ooh, about 20 about different 20. floor plans. Mm -hmm. Okay. Um, what's your best-selling floor plan right now? Well, that's a tricky question to answer because my best-selling floor plan, I can't build anymore. <laughs> <laughs> We've uh, ran out of lots to build that on. Okay. Um, but the 3525, our mutual client, um, the one that they built, has been very popular out here. Mm -hmm. And Perry Homes, our design numbers are the square footage, so 3,500 square foot home. Mm -hmm. um, got a couple 4,000 square foot homes under construction right nice. now. Nice. Um, one story? Those are two stories. Two stories? Yes, sir. I go up to 3,700 square feet on a one story. The thing I like about what I experienced with our, our mutual client, the, the way the home, he was able to transition from, it was a, it was a three car, so it was a one car, and then it was like a two, a three car, a two car tandem, so basically mm -hmm. a three car garage, but he was able to eliminate that third car slot and put a media room instead. You can put a media room. Yes, sir. So I like that you can actually play with the floor plans. And, and maneuver within reason. Yes, sir. Um, you can make some adjustments, basically. Yeah. yeah. So you're not locked into, well, that's what you see, that's what you get. There's actually some wiggle room to make some changes, right? Yes, sir. Uh, most of our plans have a handful of structural options that you know, convert a bedroom to an office if it doesn't have one already. Uh, but when we're talking about that larger square footage, uh, most of my homes are going to have you know, an office, a game room, four bedrooms, three and a half bathrooms already so mm -hmm. uh, but yeah we do have wiggle room what is perry known for there's a couple things one i would say is our one story designs um we had fantastic branched out plans absolutely um and the other thing is going to be what we include in our base price 
uh, where you can kind of feel nickel and dimed by other builders when you go to their design center. Um, I like to tell everybody what's included in our homes. Um, you know, smart home package, tankless hot water heaters, eight foot doors, the walls and windows in our floor plans, mm -hmm. very open concept. Um, none of that's gonna cost any extra with us. Mm -hmm. And that's just a very short list. The list goes on and off. On and off. Mm -hmm. Yeah, but we have, we, have, I mean, we have a bunch of cameras in here right now. We don't have any lighting set up on purpose because of the natural light coming in through all of these windows. Um, it's, it's, pretty, it's pretty amazing. I mean, because then that means the person that buys a house like this doesn't have to turn the lights on as much. Yes, sir. So they're able to save on their energy bill. And um, it's just a well-built home. Your one stories um, blow me away. The architectural detail, so the width of the, of the walkway, the hallway, the height of the ceilings. You mentioned eight-foot doors. With a lot of builders, that is an upgrade. You'd have to um, do like a 10-foot plate in order to get eight-foot doors on the first floor. Uh, so to see that you have an eight-foot door on a one-story makes it even that grander than it, than it you know, well, than, than it is. I mean, yes, even like the counter, I'm looking at the counter right here, and this, the length of this countertop, good night. I mean, yeah. that's got to be, what, 10 feet maybe? I don't know, a little I, more than I that? believe it's 11 feet by four and a half feet for that island. Um, the whole backside is functional storage. We don't waste any space. Yeah, just a good, good use of space, man. Um, plenty of room for entertaining. I mean, we're, we're in the living room right now. You have a, a breakfast nook in the corner, but it has <laughs> an oversized table so you can put a, like a, a, a huge you, eight seater that might what's that a two four that's a six seater but you can easily fit an eight seater over there it's designed comfortably. To, to fit a, a formal dining set wow wow i'm 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 blown away I, I sell a lot of homes i've seen a lot of different builders i've seen a lot of different product and i haven't seen anything quite like this um it's impressive well, thank you it's that's impressive a yeah. lot of fun to work here yeah even when I go, I, I visit um, my client a lot who lives in the community, and every time I go in, it, it doesn't get old. You know, you go in and you go, man, this is really a nice floor plan. Man, this is really a nice floor plan. Um, I think we get everybody when you first walk in the front door, we've yeah. got the big entryways, uh -huh. see all the way to the back of the house, all the natural light. It's, there's a wow factor with the Perry home. Absolutely, absolutely. Awesome. Well, tell me about the community. So. We're in a 70-foot product right now. What what are they offering in this community as far as product? As far as pro other products? Mm -hmm. So we have the 40-foot uh, product, kind of geared towards our um, first or second time home buyer, uh, ranging from 1,500 square feet up to about 2,300, 2,400 square feet. We have 50-foot wide lots. Where we're ranging from 1,800, 1,900 square feet up to about 3,000. And then we have the 60 and 70-foot wide lots that I represent, which we are going anywhere from 2,700 square feet up to 4,100. Okay, cool. Um, I noticed that there is like a massive body of water, a little lake. What's the story on that? So uh, the developer wanted to keep some of the history of the land when they purchased this. And a little bit of backstory is this 3,300 acres was a uh, family owned ranch. Um, got to the point where the patriarch couldn't keep up with the land anymore and kids were off doing their own thing. So the, it was sold, but they wanted to honor that family. Um, the 20 acre lake was something that was originally built by uh, Mr. Vincent. And uh, it was a nice place for him to uh, have his wife come at the end of the day and see him finishing up and, and nice relaxing area. Um, so it was named after her, um, Lake Eloise. Lake Eloise, okay. Mm -hmm. But um, that was something that she really wanted oh, probably two decades ago now. Um, wow. And so he had that made for him. Wow. Went all out and made it 20 uh, acres. You think? <laughs> <laughs> yeah. You know, my wife, she, if she says, you know, I want a water feature, I'm like, all right, well, let's get a pool. Yeah. You know, he built a lake. <laughs> yes, sir. And it's, it's stocked, right, with fish? It is. That's very nice. So if you live in the community, you can go fish and... Yes, sir. Like, it is private for uh, the homeowners out here. Mm -hmm. um, you sign a little waiver with the HOA and get your uh, fishing pass. That's awesome, man. Very good. Um, what's coming to the community? I know we got the homes, you got mm -hmm. the lake, uh, I know we got the amenity center. What else is, is planned to come to this area? 
So I mentioned briefly that this was uh, 3,300 acres mm -hmm. that was purchased. Um, goes all the way to 287 um, on the east side there. Uh, that whole stretch along that highway is zoned for commercial. They have plans to bring in the, you know, dining, entertainment, um, shopping, all those little amenities um, that a community needs. Uh, so a lot of growth out here. Probably, it's tough for me to say because I'm not involved in that part, but I'd imagine five, six years from seeing something like that really start developing mm -hmm. as the community continues to grow. There's supposed to be some schools coming to the community as well? well yeah, um, if in the community, we've got an elementary school zoned with Northwest ISD. Um, down the street, less than a mile, there's already an elementary school and middle school here. And then you go to Northwest High School, which is down 114, about 10, 15 minutes. Yeah, location is great. Literally, if, if I wanted to get to the airport, 114 is like right there. Yes, sir. That's like 25 minute drive, if that. I mean, straight, straight to DFW. Mm -hmm. So, or if I want to go downtown Dallas, you know, 30 minutes, 35 minutes, 114, you know. So the location is, is, is really good. Um, the entrance is, it's a, it's a, I know it's not finished yet, but it's got the huge um, R's yes, um, that are hanging. Do you know what the inspiration was behind that? Uh, just the, the, the size of the, mm -hmm. um, you know, it was funny, but talking to the developer, this was uh, probably six months ago, mm -hmm. um, they wanted something that would fill out the, the entrance. It is a big area. It's a big area. Um, and he made a joke that he had accidentally made the most grand entrance that the, the developing company has ever made for any of the neighborhoods. And it was just <laughs> by accident, just trying to use up the space. But no, it's, it's a site. It's huge. Yes, sir. Yeah. And I, it's not finished yet, but it's come a long way from what it was. Actually, I have a video I'm going to put in here. I, I met the installers when they were installing the, the letters and they, they were they actually gave me like a little tour and showed me the product. So I'll, I'll put that video in here as well. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Luke's here. My man, Edwin Liddy. Nice to meet you, sir. Yeah, this is, this is awesome. I've been waiting to see what they were going to do with the entrance. Mm -hmm. And now I'm blown away. Man, it's not done yet. We got, we got a big old sign to hang under this yeah. wooden beam. Really? Yeah, we're about to hang it here and let, as soon as they get done welding up there. Oh, my gosh. Over here on the ground, you see it? Yeah, yeah. They're going to show us the sign that's going up over here in Renew. When I told you it's going to be a big deal, it's a big deal. This is crazy. If you look up, they're actually welding the steel that's going, that's hanging the, uh, the wood. And then this is the sign that's gonna be, that's gonna go under the wood. Oh man. You know why they're doing this? Because it's a master plan community, all right? This is gonna be a 10 year plus project. If the entrance is this nice, what do you think the community is gonna be? Let me put it to you that way. You guys got to come out of, you know, you were complaining about there was nothing to see when you drove by. You didn't know there was an entrance. Well, now you can't miss it. <laughs> it's boom. It's like that big. Everything is bigger in Texas. That's what I'm talking about. Come on, we got it. I'm going to show you the community, show you the lake. I'm going to show you some stuff. Let's talk more over there. Appreciate your time, yes, brother. Yes, yes sir. sir. Have a good one. All right, now. But I'm excited to think about what this is going to be, you know, in a few years which means now is a great time for people to consider buying into this community. Yes, sir. Um, because it's priced to sell at this point. We just talked about a mutual client who basically made a six figures in equity since he's been here. Uh, but it's, this just seems like a community where the value will continue to grow as the amenity center comes in, as the different, um, you know, the commercial comes in and the, the roads are being done and people start to learn more about the community. Yes, sir. Um, so I'm trying to get the word out. Hopefully this video will get the word out. So this is, this is Connor, he's with Perry Homes. He sells Perry Homes, he's not a realtor, okay? So he works for, for, for Perry Homes, all right? But he's great at what he does. I am a realtor. So hopefully you see this video and you say, hey Ed, you know what, let's go talk to Connor um, and go get a, a Perry home. Um, it, the process was very smooth, um, you know, and, and I'm talking from experience. You know, even when there were hiccups, it's like they went away like this, uh, just working together to hash out any issues. And at the end of the day, it's all about the client being happy with the product and happy when they move in. 
and no buyer's remorse, then I can honestly say that through experience that it's been all thumbs up. So I want to thank you for, you know, not only being a part of the process. No, so my wife started the process when she was here, mm -hmm. and then it, it got handed over to you, and you just picked up where she left off. And it's like, you know what? It's, it's been seamless. It's been smooth. I love stuff like that. That's I'm right. almost spoiled. You know, now <laughs> I deal with all the builders, and it's like, okay. And sometimes it's like pulling teeth, you know, yep. trying to get things done. Everybody's not on the same page. And it's like, why can't we all just get along? Yes, sir. <laughs> We've got, but, <laughs> we've got the same goal, right? Everyone right. wants to get the client in the house. Everyone wants everyone to be happy. Right. So why can't we work on just, the same team? Let's just work on the same team. Let's get it done. Get the deal done. But um, I'm excited. I'm excited for what is to come. I, I'm excited because I see the potential in the area. I, I see the potential here. And, um, man, I, I wish you all the best. And let's, let's get, get some of these homes sold. Yes, sir. Look forward to working with you some more. Awesome, man. Is there... One thing I wanted to ask before I close the video, what type of incentives, as of this video, because you may watch this video two years from now and the incentives, the incentives doesn't exist. As of right now, what are you guys offering? As of right now, we have a $30,000 um, interest rate buy down. So any one of my homes, whether that's a new build that we're starting from scratch on or one of my homes that we're, we have under construction already for a quick move in, um, let's, let's get up $30,000, let's buy down that interest rate and let's I mean, it's really that uh, goes so much further as far as monthly payments than just taking that off the price of the home. Mm -hmm. Much more affordable. Okay. Awesome. Can they use that to pay towards closing costs instead? Yes, sir. Yeah, so we're advertising it as a uh, interest rate buy down. Okay. Um, but if that's not the best fit for uh, your particular situation, um, we can take it towards closing costs or off the purchase price. Or mm -hmm. if you really want, you know, a different upgrade in there. Let's mm -hmm, cancel mm -hmm. that out. Mm -hmm. Which you probably won't because like you said, They're loaded. The, the house comes loaded with uh, things that are desirable. <laughs> this is not like you're just throwing, you know, laminate, mm -hmm. you know, our design counters. team this does good stuff, a man. lot of market research when they, when it goes into designing our inventory mm -hmm. homes. Mm -hmm. Well, awesome. Is there anything else you'd like to add before we uh, close this out? I think we covered it all. I think we covered it all, too. Sure. All right, well, Edwin Liddy here with the Liddy Real Estate Group, brokered by JP and Associate Realtors out of Grapevine, bringing you another video. Just trying to let you know what's available. You gotta think outside the box. This, is, this may be your next community, all right? If you wanna come see it, give me a call, shoot me a text, email, phone number is the best way to get me. I will personally bring you out here. If you are out of state, um, let's make an appointment. I could probably do a Zoom, um, get you in touch with Connor, walk you through the community virtually. Um, it's not impossible if you're an investor, you're trying to get in. Let me know. Basically, opportunity is still here. You may look up one day and say, okay, you know, a year from now, it's time. And you may be priced out at that point. So take advantage of what they have going on right now. Don't be afraid to build. Don't be afraid of the homes that are available right now because Sometimes you get a, a little incentive on top of right, that as well. That's where you're going to get the best deal. Best bang for the buck yes, right sir. there. Yeah. Well, I appreciate it, man. Thank you so much for your time. It's been a pleasure. Yes, sir. Thanks for All coming right. out. Signing out. Bye-bye.